Hey everybody and welcome back to another episode of Box Nation. So my last attempt failed completely, I was not able to run the game, but this time I'm really positive. I'm running this on a new computer, actually an old computer, it's a very slow computer, so it will probably lag, but it just it's not working on, on my new uh, computer, it's just it's not working, you saw my previous episode. So again, what is Box Nation? Box Nation is a new indie game that was just uh, released on Steam today, I think, if you're watching this probably yesterday. But anyway, it's new, it's amazing, it's about blogs, I love it. And I want to show it, you guys. It's definitely worth the money, but it's, um, yeah, it's um, early access. So be warned, please work, I beg you. Oh, it works! It, it, it actually works, you have no idea how much that means to me. So <laughs> I'm actually able to record it. No uh, stupid episode again. Okay, during a uh, tutorial mode, show skills and important events in the game pause mode is on. Welcome to the game, here's your small box nation. Yeah, so what's going on? Um, I'm, I'm, I will explain in a moment. So we are playing a box nation. This this couple of boxes that are we. Now unfortunately, uh, due to my computer being a bit um, yeah on the slower side, I can't really scroll here. So I, I'm, I'm, I will try to find, some, find something out, but I doubt that I will be able to run this game because the game, it's not running on a new computer. I have no idea why, it just, it's not running. The new game button does absolutely nothing. So, okay, uh, how does this work? You have a main block, it's this one. This main, you can ignore the tutorial, it's stupid. It doesn't make any sense, it's broken English anyway. So you have this uh, main box and you're able to build new blocks. If, in order to build a block, you need you need to use Boxium. Boxium is this resource on the left. Now, let's try to build us a Boxium. So to build it, we select this block, the one that is below the red, uh, sorry, the gray circle. And we click Build Box. And you see, it costs us one Boxium. Now we received a new Go away tutorial. Now we received a new um, block here on the right. Now I, I'm going to build another box, and another box, and another box. And now the fun starts. I select randomly any box, like this. Please tutorial go away. I select uh, randomly this box, and now I can press either the left or the right uh, button of statistics. It's it's not statistics. Statistics is completely wrong. You know, it's early access, so just uh, keep up with me. So we press this left button and go away tutorial. The tutorial will not appear later. I, I think you can't disable the tutorial. I'm not sure why. So uh, we click link. And after we click link, we select where we want to link it. I want to link it to this block here. This block here on the down. Now I select the shadow where the block will, block will be linked. So I want it to be here on the left. Of this block on the left. I click on the left and it's there just like that. Now I can move each single block and slowly uh, relink it to this place. Now um, that is very tedious and I would really wish for some button combination or shortcuts because that would be make it much more fun and enjoyable. But it will come, it will come. That's just early access and it's only a couple a matter of time now. So let's link uh, all blocks slowly but surely to the left, uh, to this Boxium block. Uh, because this Boxium block is basically uh, a mine. We need to mine it. Uh, please, game. Please. It's not working. Why isn't working? Sometimes, sometimes it behaves very weirdly. I don't know why. So um, probably because it's early access. So anyway, now we don't have enough blocks. Now, whatever you do, don't touch these blocks, these blocks below, because if you touch them, something bad will happen. <laughs> and uh, I could show you if I take this block and relink it, let's say, um, let's say, please game, let's say uh, here, then I will create a hole. And when I create, when I try to create new blocks now, like this, one, two, Free, and now look, when I press it again, something bad will happen. Again, this block, it will just fall down. See, because it was not linked. That is a bit hard to grasp, but once you understand it, it's actually easy. So what we need to do is, we need to make sure that um, there's something below. That the new, newly, created, newly created block are actually securely linked. I, I mean, it, it, it's a bit stupid, honestly. I think this should change that. 
But anyway, that is how the game is currently, and that is what we will deal with. Now, I know frame rate, you know, my frame rate is probably 1 FPS, but oh no, uh, we are getting attacked, and I was not even able to. Oh, come on, game. I was not even able to. to do anything. What, what is going on? I, I'm not ready yet. Why am I attacked? Okay, let's be fast. We need to mine. Oh, I think I'm, I'm, I'm totally botched this. I totally botched this. Where is the box, Yom? I don't get it. It's a bit... Oh, no! Um, I think I botched it royally. So I need to make sure that the box, Yom block is accessible. Is it now? Okay, now, now it's... I think it's... Ex anyway, ignore the tutorial. It's it's just confusing and it's not... It's broken English anyway. So um, what are we going to do now? We're going to give uh, a block a task. Instead of being linked, we will create a miner. Now this block will start moving. You heard it right, it will move and it will glitch. So it doesn't care if something is in its way, it doesn't care at all. It will just glitch and destroy any, or not even destroy, it just, it will pass through all obstacles. Like look here, it will just pass through. See, it, it passed through. That is, that is insane. That is a ghost block basically. Um, I think it's all a, early access, it won't stay like, like that probably, but uh, yeah, it, it's like that now. And you see already, it's a bit of a, how should I say it, it's a big, bit of Dwarf Fortress, but amazing. It's basically Minecraft, but I don't, I don't even know, it's just Minecraft, but it's not better than Minecraft, it's just, it's different. Yeah, so anyway, what this really reminds me is Lego. I mean, yeah, Elephant in the Room, it's Lego, obviously. Um, it's inspired by Lego. And when I was uh, little, I always dreamed of some sort of Lego simulation. But you know, not just like some cheap game that Lego released, but like a real simulation where things would move and uh, some action would happen. And I still think that is as close as I, as I can get. So this is literally... In, this is Lego, but interactive with intelligent blocks. Like, look at it. It actually mines uh, this block. Now, why do I mine this? I mine this because I need boxium. Each uh, mined point gives me one box boxium. And one boxium will provide me with another block I could create. Now, um, we are not attacked yet, hopefully, but it's only a matter of time. So let's build more blocks. Let's build more of them. And we can slowly but surely uh, your goal is to defeat Anonymous Mother Box. Now, that reminds me of Dungeon Keeper, actually. <laughs> uh, wow, that is, that is literally Dungeon Keeper. Uh, somebody is attacking my dungeon heart, and I don't like that at all. Let's create um, an attacker. Yes, we will create an attacker block, but in order for it to work, uh, we need to create a passageway to the... I mean, I'm gonna call it Dungeon Heart, because it's, it's a Dungeon Heart, basically. <laughs> So it's literally the fortress uh, combined with Lego combined with um, Dungeon Keeper. This is it. And we just completed the tutorial. We defeated the Dungeon Heart. And that is how it works. That is exactly how it works. And it is amazing. Now, okay. Uh, I don't know how long are we already recording. Let me, let me check for a moment. Uh, yeah, so uh, there's still some time. We can check out... Uh, a real game, it's not a tutorial. So let's let's take a peek. I don't know how far we'll get, but a um, small peek is something we will have. We still have time to. Oh, so uh, oh, and time is running out. So we have limited time uh, that we can collect these blocks. Now uh, I have a bad feeling. Uh, one thing, wow, light and refinery, and this is wow, this is and sell. We can sell stuff. That looks very interesting. However, okay, let's not let's not touch this block. I, I forgot that we should build blocks first. Now, unfortunately, I don't think we can cancel out yet the task, so I, I messed up. Oh, okay, that, that's bad. I should not have done that. Uh, so let's move it again. Yeah, so because uh, my computer is not able to run this and I'm using this old one, uh, I don't think I will be able to do a series on this because it just doesn't work properly. I, I will try to figure some workaround, but I'm not really optimistic. Um, I will buy a new computer eventually, but I just don't understand why it's not working. I mean, it's it, it's it's a Mac from 2019. Why doesn't it work? You know, uh, why 
just nothing happens when I press the new game button. But anyway, it's uh, it's early access and hopefully it will be fixed. And when it when it will be fixed, then I definitely revisit this. So let's try. Maybe it is still playable. You know, maybe it can be done even if it's slow as I don't even know what. Um, okay, so I will. I want to mine at least one of these blocks. Come on, give me one block. If I can mine one block, I, I, will be, I would be so happy. Um, what is going on? Can the blocks actually climb? That I'm not sure. I think they can. Uh, so let's try to reach that block. Unfortunately, I don't know um, how we can uh, rotate in different dimensions because but right now I can only move around. I, I was not able to find a single rotation button. Um, so let's just move on without rotation then. Maybe I can ask the developer about rotations. Maybe uh, there's a forum. I will look around. It's a new Steam game. It just came out. People will ask questions. I mean, I'm, I can't be the only idiot right now. Some other people will uh, misunderstand everything and then somebody will hopefully answer. Now, uh, this doesn't look very interesting to you maybe because I'm just sitting here and pressing uh, things. But it will be amazing once these little tasks are optimized. The moment you have actually short keys, uh, short links for um, the tasks I'm doing right now, it will be amazing. It's only right now. The issue is only right now. And I'm not sure why this is not working. I'm trying to reach the 37 block. And what is going on? Uh, why? Why is it? I think I'm failing royally here. Um, please link, not link from Zelda, uh, please link this to this, this box to this box. Uh, so it's a very boxy situation and I, I'm feeling really boxed in right now. Um, excuse my horrible puns. So anyway, um, yeah, I'm, what is the aim of the game, you may ask yourself. So the aim of this game, well, what's the aim of Minecraft, you know? What's the aim of Dwarf Fortress? What's the aim of Dungeon Keeper? Okay, Dungeon Keeper has actually, um, has actually a goal. But I would say in this, it's similar to Dwarf Fortress. Your goal is just to survive. Because I can imagine it will be very tough. When we are attacked, it will be very tough. Uh, right now, I don't think the game is advanced enough to have serious dynamics in regard to diff difficult enemies. I, I assume all enemies will be very basic. But the moment will come when the enemies will be really tough and then you will wish <laughs> for an easy mode. Um, now, unfortunately, it's link mode select. No, what is it doing? So, oh no, oh no. Okay, now everything start, starts to go downhill. Uh, yeah, um, so you need a very good graphic card for this. A very good one. Because my GeForce is not enough. Hmm. I don't know, I'm, I'm playing it, for your reference, on a MacBook Pro 2015. So I would assume that is enough, but apparently not. And I think the developer should fix his specifications, because according to his specifications on Steam, my notebook should run this. That is literally what's, what's, what, what's said on Steam. It should work, but you see, it, it's not really working. Um, so. Maybe, uh, to his defense, maybe the issue is actually my recording. Maybe the recording is that what kills it. Maybe it's not designed to be recorded. That's an issue that sometimes is unavoidable. Some games are just not designed to be recorded. And that's um, that's a pity. But we can at least uh, enjoy where it lasts. I think I can still mine this block. If I could mine this block, I would be so happy. Seriously, guys, I would be so happy if I could just mine this block. Uh, for a sense of accomplishment, and yeah, it really feels like Lego. I, I love Lego, and this game has so much potential. I mean, just look right now, all blocks have the same color, but imagine if you could actually recolor them. Uh, you could maybe even, I don't know, build something with these blocks that would act as a sort of computer. So much opportunity is hidden in this gem, but it's not yet um, there. It's not yet there, and that's a shape. But it will be, I'm sure of it. Um, what's a bit of a problem, I think, is the name. The name, uh, what was the name again? I actually forgot the name of the game. Wow, that is so professional. So anyway, uh, the name of the game uh, clashed with a famous American brand or something. 
When I tried to google it, even on YouTube, I couldn't find anything and this strange brand appeared. I'm from Britain and have no idea uh, what this American brand is, but it's an issue and it will overshadow, I think, the name of this game, at least for a short time. But uh, hopefully Google will be smart enough uh, to sort that out. Okay, uh, I did it. I collected it. We did it. We have now a working, um, I think, path. And please, please, tell me that, that if this will work. Because if this fails right now, I'll be so angry. Um, <laughs> mine, please mine my uh, block. Please do it. I beg you. It's not mining. It's not mining! Oh my god, it's actually not mining. I can't believe it. <laughs> so, okay, that that was a huge a huge failure. Um, okay, that... Um, <laughs> uh, I, okay, I, I think the blocks are not smart enough to climb. I have severely overestimated them. Oh, no way, I can't... Uh, don't tell me I need to do everything from zero. No way, I won't do that. Um, Please, please, game, don't, don't don't let me do everything again. Um, that that would be so terrible. <laughs> yeah, so uh, you can clearly see I'm I'm bad at this. Um, and yeah, so if you love Lego, if you love games like Dwarf Fortress, Dungeon Keeper, Minecraft, you're gonna love this. It's amazing. And um, it it I hope if you want to buy this game, it's it's right now on Steam. I think it costs only four pounds or something. Really cheap. But you need a powerful computer because <laughs> my mine fails completely here. Um, I don't even know. Can I can I please build another block? And, and this one, this body is really irritating to me. He is doing something. Attack the dimension breakthrough. Oh no! Now some, somebody is attacking us. Um, now maybe maybe that's a good thing. Now why that's a good thing? Don't think I'm crazy. It's a good thing because they might actually create some space for me. Because I'm I'm confused as heck. I have no idea what I'm doing here. They are building for me right now, and <laughs> the thing is, it takes time to build in this game. Maybe it's because uh, again of my uh, slow computer, but they are building much faster than I'm building. So I'm happy. Let them build. Let them do whatever they want. Let them live. Okay. What? Did they just kill my miner? Did they just kill my miner? Okay. I can't. I I, I can't say I like that. Um, okay, so since they decided to randomly kill my miners, I'm really, really pissed. I don't like that. Uh, let's create an attacker and let's deal with them. And you see, they already built a lot of great things. And we will make use of that in a moment. But right now, let's create an attacker. He takes three boxiums and we are running out of boxiums. Oh no, that is not good. Well, anyway, I think you're about to die right now. Um, please don't die. <laughs> yeah, let's... Uh, oh, it's, it, will it actually kill the heart? It actually killed the heart and it destroyed all our blocks. And no, everything is going downhill. Well, anyway, um, that is undoubtedly an amazing game. <laughs> and everything is falling, falling apart. Anyway, it's an undoubtedly an amazing game if you can get it to run, because it doesn't run on this computer, it just... It's laughably laggy. It's not supposed to be played like this. I mean, I don't know if you realize, if I start scroll around, like it it, it, it lags like one FPS. And there's even another heart, another civilization that was not even aware existed. So well, I won't give up. I will try to get this game to run because I have a much more powerful computer. It, it, just, it just doesn't run on it. You know, I have another episode recorded where I try uh, tried to get it to work and it just didn't. So okay guys, uh, I hope you've enjoyed it so far. I will link uh, the, um, the link for the game in the description. You should, you should definitely buy it if you enjoyed games, if you enjoy games like that. And yeah, I'll see you next time.